Hi. Today's lesson is about grammar. In order to improve your grammar and improve your writing skills, you need to differentiate between the four structures of sentences. In the English language, the sentence is structured in four ways. The first structure is the simple sentence. The second is the compound sentence. The third is the complex sentence. And finally, the compound complex sentence. Let's have a look at these four structures of sentences with examples. The first structure is the simple sentence. The simple sentence consists of one independent clause with no subordinate clause. An independent clause is a complete sentence with a subject, a verb, and complete thought. However, the subordinate clause is an incomplete sentence. It gives more information about the independent clause. Let's have an example. Susan read King Lear and reported on it yesterday. King Lear is a famous play of Shakespeare. The subject in this sentence is Susan, the verb, read, reported. It's a compound verb. So the sentence here is a simple sentence with one independent clause. Susan read King Lear and reported on it yesterday. We notice that here we do not have a subordinate clause. Number two is the compound sentence. The compound sentence, in fact, is a combination between two simple sentences, two simple sentences. Or we can say that the compound sentence consists of two independent clauses with no subordinate clause. An example of that is, she answered the question, so, her teacher rewarded her. We notice that in this sentence, in this compound sentence, we have two simple sentences. She answered the question, and the second one is, her teacher rewarded her, and they are combined by the coordinated conjunction, so. Remember that the coordinated conjunctions are for, and, nor, but, or, yet, so and they are combined with the abbreviation fanboys. So this is a compound sentence. The third structure is the complex sentence. And the complex sentence consists of one independent clause with at least one subordinate clause. An example, Mike passed the test because he studied hard. The independent clause is my passed the test. And the subordinate clause is because he studied hard. So this is a complex sentence. The fourth structure of sentences is the compound complex sentence. An example is he doesn't bring the book that he needs, so he will lose a mark. We notice that the compound complex sentence consists of two independent clauses and at least one subordinate clause. He doesn't bring the book, independent clause. That he needs, subordinate clause. So he will lose a mark, he will lose a mark independent clause. So these are, in short, the four structures of sentences. You will need to change the structure of your sentences, especially when you are taking a writing test. This will help you a lot increasing your band score or your mark. I hope from now on you will be able to use the different structure of sentences in your writing, when you write a paragraph or an essay, and of course for your grammatical skills. Until next time, take care.